Hey there, Chris Music here. Okay. Day 28 of Scooby Doo, second to last film mm -hmm. with Shaggy. Shaggy Showdown, which is a western. A western. All about with Shaggy's descendant, Dapper Jack. Yeah, who's an or, outlaw. Yeah, I suppose. So but, we think. Yeah. But yeah, his name cleared at the end. Mm -hmm. I like the design of the ghosts, too. Yeah, he was, yeah, he did like cool shot uh, green flames out of a uh, uh, pistol. pistols, or not pistols, revolvers. Yeah, which is cool. Yeah, that was pretty cool. And um, yeah, it's funny. Yeah, it was funny. Yeah, that's um, a good one. Kate Micucci is officially, or I guess he, she started in Haunted Hollywood. Haunted Hollywood, and yeah. the WWE As one Velma. was the first like. Non Lego one. Mm -hmm. This is her second one. Um, she's not as warm as Mindy Cohen. <laughs> no, she's a little more. Definitely harsher. Yeah. But well, and it it was funny in this one, but it didn't help that she was enraged about that El Cabong font. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, but it was funny. She had Fonts a not. very, very particular problem, mm -hmm. and it had justified it in the end because it led her to. The culprit. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, another one written by the creator of The Weekenders, Doug Langtown. Mm -hmm. If you haven't watched The Weekenders, what other one did he write? Um, what was it? He wrote a couple. Fantasaur, he wrote, and I forget the other one. I know he wrote Legend of the Fantasaur. Maybe Camp Scare as well. But. uh yeah, and um, uh, fucking <laughs> what did he say? Fred Shaggy was really good at cowboy stuff. Yeah, Fred was not. Fred was either. not good at yeah. cowboy stuff, unfortunately. Yeah, but I liked his little bit with all the nets. Yeah, <laughs> going over his different nets <laughs> yeah. and strength and weaknesses of each. Mm hmm. Ricky had some interesting thoughts about the Mr. Machine and how it could work and like mm -hmm. have a whole network of yeah, like, like supplies. in the back, the, it's a lot of wasted space if you see yeah, it's look just at Scooby it. and Shaggy back there yeah. for the most part. So you could do a little workbench and like storage unit area for mm -hmm. all their trap stuff, and then on the other side you could have uh, which she's had before Velma's little. Computer setup. Computer setup. Research I mean, you, area. You could even... They don't use the back doors all that much. No. You could even do something on the back there and then maybe have like a little kitchen area. Yeah. Yeah. Not yeah. Maybe not like a stove or anything. But no. Just someplace to set up, or at least maybe a microwave at least. And mm hmm Hot plate. Hot plate. Yeah. <laughs> For steakouts or whatever. Mm-hmm. Well, you know, and it would make sense if the Mr. Machine were bigger mm -hmm. and it almost were like a camper because if they're traveling so much, mm -hmm. like maybe they all hang out in the Mr. Machine if it were bigger. But yeah, because I don't know where they stay, where they'd sleep. Yeah, maybe hotels and stuff. But for the most part, it seems like when they're traveling at night, they're lost or in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Anyway, so it's like... Well, there's five of them, and at least three of them drive the mystery machine. Daphne got her license, but I'm not sure how much she's driving, so maybe yeah. they just take shifts as well. True. I don't think I've ever That's seen why they Velma. can afford to drive everywhere. Velma's driven. I've seen Velma drive. Remember, Velma drove to... A few movies ago, when she was taking them somewhere oh, as a surprise. That's right. Where was that? In one of in one of these ones. Yeah. So they've all driven it, even Scooby. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> even Scooby has a license. <laughs> yeah. So. Yeah. But. Yeah. So that was a fun one. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow yeah, is the very last. Mm -hmm. Another Lego one, Blowout Beach Batch, which I haven't seen. Um, but it'll. It won't be the last one they ever release, well, no. but it'll be our last for what we're doing. Yeah, so we could throw on thirty and thirty-one for the all month and watch 
the movies? The live action uh, ones. No. You know, there's actually four live action ones. Right. So we could do two a day for the 30th and the 31st. Hmm. <laughs> Just saying. You, you brought it up. That's true. <laughs> I'm sorry. Manos will be done.